Good evening everyone and welcome to a new video on the channel. It is Tuesday the 6th of August 2024 and tonight at last, at long long last, I can finally say that I'm going to complete the Northern League and for it I am heading to a weir side, I think you could maybe class it as, for Washington versus Jarrow FC in Northern League Division 2. So without further ado let's get into this. This is an early season bottom v top clash so uh, as well as uh, the personal milestone um, yeah a, a bit a bit of a game where it could potentially be a bit one-sided but anyway we'll find out soon enough let's get into this Here we are then, a new one off the list. So just in the clubhouse at the ground now, we're finally, finally, finally have uh, got here and uh, can say that I've uh, once again completed the Northern League and uh, going into this game this evening, as I mentioned at the start of the video, it is a uh, bottom v top clash. Uh, Washington currently bottom of the league, having lost all of the first three games, while Jarrow top of the league, having won all of the first three games. Um, I believe Washi are the only side in the league that haven't yet registered any points, while uh, Jarrow are the only team in the league that haven't dropped any points. Um, of course, if Washington win this game tonight or it is a draw, then uh, both of those records will give, but you would uh, maybe fancy Jarrow at this moment in time. Um, I know it's still very, very early days, uh, like neither of these. 100% winning or 100% losing records are going to last, but uh, they are the form team. They'll be the ones expected to win tonight, but obviously it doesn't always work like that. Uh, Washi will want to get the season off and running, um, but I'm just so glad that I finally, finally, finally got here after a few several attempts uh, to ground a little bit. Uh, notorious for having games called off for the weather, but uh, you know, be better late than ever. I mean, I'm saying that in August, but still. Um, couple of failed attempts in the 22-23 season, a few more last season. Um, it took me quite some time, but I'm glad this finally came up and not messing about this year. They're getting here while the weather's still hot, so yeah, the, that is now uh, 42. Well, I'm not sure if it is 42 grounds in the Northern League, because there's a couple of ground shares within there, but uh, in any case, I've seen a game at every single one of them now, so uh, job done. Uh, Anyway, I'm going to just uh, chill for a bit, then we'll head into the northern area of playing fields and find out where it all unfolds. So, the teams are warming up. Uh, Washington getting ready over here. Uh, going to be in the uh, dark blue strip this evening. And Jaro over there. Of course, the usual colours look like a lighter blue, um, but it's not too easy to determine what colours are actually going to be in because they're warming up in blue socks, they've got blue shorts on, they've got yellow socks for, so uh, that's just going to be one of those we'll find out when a player's come out of the tunnel and ready to start the match. <laughs> Ooh. 
好。Getting back as well. Mm. Oh. Mm. And then I ended up. Time Washington nil, Jarrow FC nil. It is nil nil largely down to uh, the performance of the Washington goalkeeper. He's had a very fine half, uh, pulled off some decent saves. Um, really, Jarrow ought to be ahead uh, given some of the chances that they have had, but uh, it's been to no avail of yet. But to be fair, Washi had have had a couple of chances of their own, but uh, without really like, properly testing the goalkeeper yet. There was a header from the corner which the goalkeeper did have to get down to save. Um, after that, uh, there was one where it looks clean through, but uh, completely fluffed it. Then uh, another one where they've had a, a bit of a flash shot and it's gone wide. So uh, they are in the game. Uh, it's not been totally dominated and they're clinging on or anything like that. But uh, yeah, the really uh, think if Jaro don't go on and win this game, then uh, they'll maybe feel somewhat disappointed at not taking the chances. But anyway, there is another 45 minutes to go. Such a, he's had such a good game as well. Oh. 
So we are now in the 90th minute, I'm not entirely sure how much added time it's going to be. Full-time Washington nil, Jarrow won. Uh, I'll see better games this season, it goes without saying. But uh, it is job done for Jarrow, who make it four wins from four, while it is uh, four defeats from four for Washington. But uh, I think there were signs uh, a little bit there from Washington tonight that uh, like a result could be on the way fairly soon. Uh, there, did, there were some positives to take from it. Um, I think a lot of people were maybe going to that game tonight and thinking it was probably going to be a bit more comfortable for Jarrow, but I didn't make it. All that come to all, had a few chances of their own and uh, yeah, they weren't totally outplayed or anything like that. Um, it was a bit of a smash and grab kind of win for Jarrah, really, wasn't it? Um, it was a bit of an unorthodox uh, kind of moment from the goalkeeper who otherwise had a pretty good game which uh, led to the goal, but um, it, it is what it is, as I said. Uh, it wasn't a classic, but the main sort of thing for me tonight uh, was the fact that I did uh, get to the ground and uh, I've uh, finally uh, seen a game there and um, yeah, they've got the league completed as well. So uh, yeah, the, it, was, it was a nice enough set up. I've got to say it's a decent clubhouse and what have you. So um, I've, I've enjoyed my night uh, despite the fact the game uh, maybe wasn't the best. Um, but uh, that is that for this video and I'll be back tomorrow night with yet more Northern League Division 2 action and we head into a uh, battle of two newly promoted sides. It is Darlington Town versus Annick Town. So uh, looking forward to that one, uh, two uh, decent clubs. So until then, take care. Cheers for watching. See you later.